back to my channel or welcome if you're new. In today's video, I'm recreating six fall transitional outfits from Pinterest. If this sounds like something you're interested in, please stay tuned. So uh, the first outfit that I'll be recreating for this Pinterest recreation video is one where this lady's wearing, first of all, a leather skirt. She has a blue button down shirt, you know, crossed in the front and she has a turtleneck. I mean, this is more for days where it's like, you know, really, the weather's really turned. But because it's a transition video, I'm not going to have a turtleneck on or even a mock neck. But I have on this, so my version of this, and she has on, um, you know, palms, probably sling back palms. But this looks like the YSL uh, gold toe palms. And she has like a mago, uh, the raw mago bag. And so on, she has sunnies, a red lip. This is a very good look, very sleek and chic. So for me, what I'm going to do is I have on my leather skirt and this as a slit in the front, but this is what I have. I'm sure I have another leather skirt that's way longer than this, but for the purpose of this video, um, this is what I'm wearing because I have not turned over or switched, done the switch over my closet. So that skirt is not here. So let me get started. And I have this um, crop top from Off-White. So let's start recreating this video. So what I'm going to add to do is try to do like a criss, um, cross of what she has. And that way, you know, it's not a full talk that she has on. And I'll add a belt with a gold bottle, uh, buckle. But I also want to make sure that even though my shirt is way oversized, it's one of those shirts that it's, I'm not drowning in it. So what I'm going to do is try to tuck it in the proper way. So that way, you know, everything looks chic. And that's the styling of it, I guess. So once I kind of secure that, I mean, I could have used another blue shirt, but I like this one a lot. Um, it has room. It's oversized, but, you know, it's so chic. And I could just button this up here, even though I've crisscrossed it there. And I want the off-white, you know, the blackness of it to show. And she has on a uh, gold detail, so I'm going to change my earrings to reflect that. And my earrings are going to reflect that. And what else? Add sunnies, shoes, belt, and handbag. So I'm adding my um, black belt from Anderson's. I did get it, you know, probably two Christmases ago. Um, I'm thinking now. But I love that, you know, it has no logo, it's plain, it's leather, you can't really tell where it's, where, where it's from. And so, and if I wear it every time, you're not going to know where, as if I had a logo one, there's nothing wrong with a logo one, I do have a logo belt, you're going to actually know where it's from. So, that's the advantage of having that. And, and so, my belt is now on. I need to change my earrings, add sunnies and shoes. So I'm adding my um, koi, shop koi earrings. Um, like you know, if you've been on this channel for a while, you know I love big statement earrings because this is what will make this big wig. This is what, what will show under this big wig or else I would have just wasted my time trying to add earrings. Okay, I think I have that. Um, that's good. So now I'm going to add shoes. She has the, either the palms, um, the YSL palms with a gold tap. I don't have palms with gold tap. And so what I'm going to do is add my, I'm going to add my Manolo um, sling back. But this have like a white buckle detail. So that's, that works for me. It's still part of the styling. And so... You know, I, I probably, I know I don't have to match that look, you know, look for look or item for item. So I'm loving the way this is looking right now. Um, and, you know, being, adding my own touch to this outfit makes it totally mine. Now I have to add sunglasses and add a handbag and I'm done. 
So for sunglasses, I'm adding my Celine sunglasses. I love the cat eyeness of this. This is more of, you know, I love cat eye sunglasses. That's the best shape of sunglasses that look good on my face and bag. And for M bag, I'm adding my Pauline bag. It's not as big as the uh, Romago one, but it will get the job done. And so I could either do this or just carry it like that. And I love this for me. So this is the first look. Let me know how I did. And, you know, I love this look. Until the next. Next outfit for this Pinterest recreation video is one where this lady's wearing this burgundy um, suit. This is a power suit. I love suits. If you know me, um, I, I, I love wearing suits. And I'm sure you can see I have a plethora of them right there. And so she's wearing this jacket. Um, she's ruched her sleeves up. The pants are very long, probably wide leg. And she has like... Um, salmon pinkish salmon um vest or top and she has a dior bag in that same tone and i can't really see her shoes and this is like i said it's a power suit i, I love the way this outfit looks um i can't really see her feet but i'll um put my own twist to it so i have this pants and i have the suits this suit is from the funky shop i'm wearing the pants right now i have this tank this is the closest to that outfit that i have so i have this tank it still goes from target so i'm going to tuck that in just like she has done us and i'll add oops my my zip was down i'll tuck that in so the jacket is from um the funky shop just as i had said the jacket and pants are both from the Frankie shop. So what I'm going to do is to ruch this up and to make it stay up. I'm going to add this air tie. Um, I, I, I got a pack from um, Slip. It's very good. It's not too tight and it's silk so it won't ruin the garment. Normally it's good so that it won't ruin your hair. But with this it's not going to be too tight so that it won't ruin the garment itself. <laughs> and so... That's that. I still have my earring on from the last outfit, so I'm, I'm going to keep that on because it doesn't take away from the look. And um, she doesn't have any necklace on. My earrings are very statementy. Um, I try to always have something on my neck, but because the earrings are statement statementy, I'm going to leave it like that. Um, it doesn't hurt if I put on a necklace. Let me see. So I'm adding this gold jewelry. It has some um, pearls or balls there. They're from my sister-in-law's um, Etsy shop. So I'm more of a, yeah, sometimes I'm more of a go big or go home uh, person. You know, make it all statements here. So that's that. And now all I need to do is shoes and the handbag, and I'm done. I don't have a deal, um, but I'll do with what I have. So she has the, the handbag is picking up from the burgundy of the look, but I'll add my um, my my handbag that I have. So I have this Dolce Vita um, slides or mules, and this I just got. I love it. So that's what it's going to be there. That's, that's the look. That's the shoe for this look. It has a more of a monotone or monochromatic look. I really love it. And my daughter is out there trying to distract me while I'm talking. So um, I'm going to turn the camera to her so you can see her. And so for handbag, I'm just going to add my... Um, this is from Cezanne. And so I love, love this handbag. I recently just got it. And so this is the look. It's just a monochromatic look. Everything ties in together well, except for the tank is the standout piece. So that, that way you can see it and it's accessorized. So this is the second look. 
that I've recreated from this for this video. Let me know what you think. Um, she's not wearing a belt, so I'm not bothering to wear a belt. But I actually love this look. It's given, you know, I know my uh, colors. Burgundy is in for the um, fall, winter, and I'm dressed accordingly. And so what else? I love this look. I'm not going to lie. Um, I always love every look by the time I finish recreating it. But on to the third outfit. So the next outfit um, that I'm recreating for this Pinterest recreation video is one where this lady's wearing, um, she's wearing a long button down shirt, a, a shirt dress, and with denim, with um, gold heels, sunglasses, and it's good. So because it's a fall look for me, um, I don't have a blue stripe button down shirt, um, shirt dress. Or I I think I used to, but I don't know where most of my stuff is right now. But I'll do with what I have. So I'm gonna make it a denim on denim look, but still try to take from the look. So she has a shirt dress. I have a denim shirt dress that I'm gonna add to this look. I'm gonna keep this tank top because it's um because it's a fall transitional outfit. It will be, you know, require some layering. So I'm going to keep the tank top I'm wearing, which is from Target. My denim is mother of ad for a while now. And, you know, it almost has the same vibes as, 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 as uh, that hers has. She has sunglasses, jewelry, and hoops. So let's do that real quick. So let me add my shirt dress. It's not going to be as long as hers, but it is a shirt dress. And I'll be able to style it. I don't think she's wearing a belt with hers. So I'm just going to keep it as that. And let's see where this look can take me. Um, I'm going to button all of that. All of that. She has a bit of her neck showing. But the pink is there. For me, I'm leaving the pink and the jewelry. And so it's going to be that. And so it's going to be that look. And all I need to do is add my earrings. I'm going to add hoops. She has big hoops and gold shoes. I don't see a handbag. So I'll try to make do with what I have. So let's do this real quick. I'm going to add my hoops. So since I don't... um. I have a blue shirt dress, you know, I've done that. I'm going to try and add, um, when I do go shopping next, I will add more shirt dresses to my closet because I really love them. I love the long sleeve one. I have short sleeve ones. And for the life of me looking in that direction where my dresses are, I can't find any that is, I mean, I, I can find only my white one. So I, I know I used to have a pink and blue one, but I don't know where it is. So I'm going to leave that at that. So now I need to add sunglasses. And she doesn't have a handbag on, but I'll add handbags to this look. Sunglasses, I'm going to go with my cost um, sunglasses. I'm taking the round of it from the roundness of my earrings. I'm going for that. Hopefully that, that works. And so if I was to stop here, I've recreated a look. But to add my own touch to it, I'll add my handbag. And bag, I've decided to add my Jaco Mousse. I love this bag. I did wear it a lot for New York Fashion Week. Also, let me know if you would like to see that vlog um, anytime soon. I'm still working on it, but I probably will put it out on Tuesday. Yeah, I'll put it out on Tuesday. It will be my Tuesday vlog or Tuesday video so that you can see what I got up to, what I wore, where I ate, and that's it. So this is... Um, this look and all i could do is you know put my hand back there i think i've done a good job recreating her look with what i have in my closet and to me this works and to the next outfit so the next outfit for this pinterest recreation video is one where this lady is wearing some pink um trousers long um shirt dress a uh, button down shirt dress and a uh, a vest, a sweater vest, you know, some pink heels and blue handbag. 
So what I'm going to do is I have all my pink pants from Kate. I have my shirt. Um, shirt dress is from Cos. So I'm going to button it all the way to where my belly button is right there. And then add a vest. I have a vest from H&M that I've had for a while now. So let me grab that and add to this out. So I have my vest and I'm going to add it to what I'm wearing without trying to stain it. So now that I've added my vest to this look, I need to add earrings because you know I love, you know, I have to have earrings on and shoes. So for earrings, I'm going to go for something big. So I'm going for not too big. This are more like a ball, almost a disco ball kind of earrings, but they're smaller than my Simon Miller one. And so shoes to this look. And I need shoes and a handbag. So for shoes, I'm just going to add my palms. I have my palms from Manolo. So I'm just going to add this Manolo. It's not a, a, the sh same shade of pink. And I don't really think I mind. So that's going to be that. This I'm not too sure about, although I love what it looks like. But I'm not too sure if this is a me outfit. Despite the fact that I love shirt dresses. I mean, it's not looking bad. It depends on how I adjust the shirt at the back. If I adjust it this way, it looks good. So this is better. And so I will have to make sure to adjust it that way. Although I bought something to hold my shirt. So for the purpose of going out, I probably would do that. I bought something at the, to hold the shirt at the back. I'll do that for the purpose of going out. But for this video, I'm just going to leave it. I'm not going anywhere. So for handbag, the only blue handbag I have is this one. So this is more of a powder blue. Hers is more a uh, deep blue, but this is what I have. It will work. It still does the job. And so this is my final look for this. This is my this is my take on her outfit. So let me know what you think. I I love it. Um, if I'm if if the shirt is cinched at the back, and so for purpose of going out, if I was to wear this out, I'll cinch the shirt at the back. And it looks good that way. So uh, let me know what you think. So the last but not least outfit for this Pinterest recreation video is one where this lady is wearing this oversized bl um, blazer um, and cream, uh, cropped cream top and cropped, you know, pants or trousers, a mule, uh, hem a Jacquemus handbag. This is more of an ode, ode to um, summer going away, but you're still, you know, in the fall, early fall vibes. I love this look. I've put on my um, cream pants. This is from, I can't remember for the life of me right now. And this is, this top is from H&M. No, the, the pants are from Philip Lim, I remember. And so I'm just going to add a blazer. I think I have a jacket from h m also and add my bag and put on earrings simple look very you know catchy and i love it so for this look i've added my uh, blazer it is from h m i love the look of this um is it from h m let me be sure because i don't remember buying this from h m it is actually zara so i'm 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 wrong it is zara so the blazer is Zara, a Philip Lim, H&M, and Zara. The creams don't look all too matchy-matchy, but I'm, I'm here for it. It's okay. So I need um, shoes and handbag. And to kind of make it more, I'm leaving my earrings on. I want to add like a brooch here so that that way the look is mine. This is from Koi. I love her pins or brooch. I call it a brooch, and I wear mine on my left side. So I'm going to add that real quick. So the brooch is now on. I think it probably needs to be higher, but you get the gist of it. My earrings are on, and now I need to add my... Um, I love the fact that she's, you know, ruched the sleeves up. Mine is not ruched up right now, but it's still looking good. Add my shoes. So shoes are going to be... Um, geez, what is what the life of me do with my shoes? Right there.
So here are the shoes. This is more of a, uh, it's still summer, but we're going into fall kind of look. And so I have my Aquazura Raffia Eels, and I'm transitioning this into the fall, but it's not fall yet. I know the vibe. I can wear this in the summer as it is, and I can wear it in the fall. It's one of those autumn days. And she has that Giacomo's M bag. I don't have exactly that, but I'm going to add my version of what I will add. And this is my Brandon Blackwood bag in this bamboo um, trimming. And this look I love, the gold takes from that. Hers is a cream top, I don't have a cream top or crop top and this is what I have. So let me know what you think. This is my final look for this uh, Pinterest recreation video. I've made it five, trying to ease myself in back into coming back from fashion week. So if you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to give me a like. If you're not subscribed, don't forget to subscribe and I'll let you go to the outro. Bye. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch this video. I really enjoyed recreating this um, outfits from Pinterest. And I also wanted to apologize for, you know, uh, my videos have been, you know, here or there. Or I've been at a break. I went to Fashion Week, New York Fashion Week to be precise. And, you know, I had to do some parking. And um, now I'm trying to wind down. But I'm back and I'll, ret I'll resume my normal schedule, which is the Tuesdays and Saturday videos. So thank you so much. I really appreciate you taking time to watch it again. And if you're not subscribed, please don't forget to subscribe. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to give me a like. And until next time, stay blessed. Bye.